but every single one of these spiders has their own individual personality. It's quite edgy, and any second, they could sink their fangs into you. In the intricate tapestry of nature, a hidden world of insects unfolds where danger stealthily prowls among the tiniest creatures. While some insects seem harmless, others wield lethal powers and cunning tricks. From enigmatic ants that defy traditional classification to astonishing critters in the most unexpected corners, these bugs command our caution and respect. Join us on an enthralling expedition to uncover 20 of the deadliest insects, urging you to tread carefully and steer clear of their path. Number 20. African Trypanosomiasis In the heart of sub-Saharan Africa, a tiny but deadly menace lurks. The tsetse fly, bearer of African trypanosomiasis, commonly known as sleeping sickness. Imagine a world where a mere insect bite could unleash a dangerous parasite, leading to fatigue, fever, throbbing headaches, and muscle pains. Unchecked, this sickness can swiftly escalate to a fatal outcome. Who's at risk, you ask? Travelers venturing into the wild, exploring game parks, or relishing the outdoors in affected regions tread on precarious ground. But fear not, intrepid globetrotters. There might not be a magical potion, but there's wisdom to ward off this peril. Picture yourself enveloped in protective armor. long sleeve shirts, trousers, and hats. Your shield against the relentless Setsi assault. The fabric, a medium-weight guardian, foils their attempts. Embrace neutral hues. Avoid bright or dark shades, especially blue and black, like beacons for these minuscule marauders. Venture cautiously avoiding bushes where the flies lie in wait. And when you embark on your trusty vehicle, conduct a vigilant scan. No fly shall hitch a ride unnoticed. But wait, there's more. Arm yourself with insect repellent, not just for Setsi's nefarious designs, but also to repel other buggy foes. In this battle for safe adventures, knowledge and preparation are your mightiest allies. Number 19. Deadly Lonomia, South America's Silent Menace. In the lush depths of South America, a dangerous creature lurks, its innocuous appearance belying its deadly potential. Meet the giant silkworm moth, a seemingly unremarkable insect found in the verdant landscapes of southern Brazil, Uruguay, Paraguay, and Argentina. However, this unassuming moth harbors a dark secret, particularly in its larval form, the infamous Lonomia obliqua. Clusters of spiny caterpillars, their vibrant appearance hiding a potent venom. These spines, brimming with a venomous cocktail, pose a grave threat to any unsuspecting soul. During the day, these caterpillars huddle low on tree trunks, waiting to unleash their toxic arsenal on anyone who ventures too close. Accidents often occur in remote rural areas, but the true extent of their danger remains vastly underestimated. The peril escalates in the face of deforestation and fruit tree plantations. These caterpillars flock to these fruitful havens, putting workers at significant risk. When disturbed, the venom-filled spines can pierce human skin, injecting their deadly payload. The consequences are dire, hemorrhagic symptoms, massive bleeding, and in severe cases, death. The venom's anti-clotting agents wreak havoc on the victim's body necessitating many stings for toxic effects to manifest. This nefarious creature's history traces back to 1855, when Francis Walker first documented it. In the 1960s, an epidemic of patients with hemorrhagic symptoms emerged, with L. obliqua consistently present at the scenes of these tragedies. Since then, the incidents have only increased, solidifying the caterpillar's status as one of the region's most vicious threats. Beware the silent menace of South America, the deadly Lonomia obliqua, whose vibrant appearance masks a potent danger. Stay vigilant, for in the heart of nature's beauty, a lethal force quietly resides, ready to strike the unsuspecting. Number 18. The Atrocity Spider Family In the heart of Australia's wilderness, a captivating family of spiders, the Atrocidae, reigns supreme. Popularly known as Australian funnel-web spiders or antacids, these creatures embody mystery and danger. Once considered a subfamily, Atracidae has claimed its rightful place as a separate family in the Arachnid Kingdom. Comprising three genera, Atrax, Hadroniki, and Illawarra, this family boasts 35 distinct species, each with unique charm. However, their beauty veils a dangerous secret. 
Several members of the Atrocity family wield venom potent enough to pose a threat to human lives. Among them, the Sydney funnel-web spider, Atrax robustus, and its counterpart, the northern tree-dwelling funnel-web spider, Hadronici formidabilis, stand out as potentially deadly predators. In the past, encounters with these spiders struck fear into the hearts of those who tread upon their territories. Yet thanks to modern first aid techniques and anti-venom, fatalities have become a thing of the past. Nevertheless, the mystique surrounding the Atrocidae family persists, reminding us of the delicate balance between fascination and danger that characterizes the natural world. So next time you venture into the wild heartlands of Australia, keep an eye out for these deadly yet elegant arachnids and marvel at the wonders of nature's intricate design. Number 17. Tick. Tick paralysis is no joke, and your furry friends are at risk. It's not just a problem. It's a ticking time bomb, especially in places like New South Wales, where these tiny terrors thrive. Picture this. Your dog or cat suddenly wobbly, panting heavily and struggling to stand. That's the terrifying reality of tick poisoning, a deadly condition caused by these minuscule but mighty creatures. In Sydney's North Shore and Northern Beaches, the paralysis tick, Ixodes holocyclus, lurks in unexpected places waiting to strike. Cats might be a bit more resilient, but they're not invincible. If your pet's body temperature rises, the symptoms worsen, making early detection crucial. Within three to five days of a tick attachment, signs become apparent, progressing rapidly within 24 to 48 hours. Danger lingers even after removing the tick, as symptoms can surface days later. Keep that removed tick in a sealed container. It could save your pet's life. Watch for heavy breathing, coughing, vomiting, and wobbly legs. Tick paralysis doesn't discriminate. It affects pets across the board, from dilated pupils to weakened voices, leading to paralysis. So how can you help? Stay vigilant. Check your pets regularly, especially if they've been in tick-prone areas. Act fast and remember your quick action could mean all the difference. Don't wait until it's too late. Learn the signs, stay aware, and let's beat tick paralysis together. Your pet's life might depend on it. Number 16. Australia's fearsome bulldog ant. Nature's silent assassin. In the sun-soaked coastal regions of Australia resides an unassuming yet deadly creature, the bulldog ant, Myrmecia pyroformis, rightly dubbed the world's most dangerous ant. Its reputation as a fierce predator precedes it. This diminutive insect is a force to be reckoned with. Picture this, a creature so audacious that it fearlessly challenges humans, displaying unparalleled aggression and striking with lightning speed. What sets this apart is its astonishing ability to use its sting and jaws simultaneously, injecting potent venom with each relentless bite. The bulldog ant has earned its name not merely for its appearance, but for its unwavering determination during an attack. When threatened, it clamps down with its long, toothed mandibles, contorts its body, and thrusts its barbless sting deep into the skin. The consequences of this encounter can be fatal, there have been several documented human fatalities, the most recent being a brave Victorian farmer in 1988. This miniature silent assassin leaves a lasting impact, its venom racing through the veins of its victims, leading to swift and, at times, fatal consequences within a mere 15 minutes. The bulldog ant's audacious attacks serve as a chilling reminder of the raw power of nature lurking in the most unexpected places. Beware the quiet menace of the bulldog ant, for in its tiny frame resides the potency to challenge even the mightiest creatures on Earth. Number 15. Southern Africa's Latrodectus Spiders In the heart of Southern Africa, a fascinating yet potentially scary creature resides, the button spider, a local term that invokes a shiver down the spine. These arachnids, scientifically classified under the Latrodectus genus within the Therididae family, boast an intriguing diversity of species, including the notorious black and brown widow spiders recognized worldwide. What makes these spiders the talk of the town is their venom, a potent concoction capable of wreaking havoc upon humans. While all Latrodectus species carry venom, the females pose a significant threat thanks to their robust delivery mechanisms. 
Although fatalities are rare, their bites send excruciating pain through victims' bodies, warranting urgent medical attention. Southern Africa hosts seven Latrodectus species, six indigenous, with the possibility of an imported one. Interestingly, despite their menacing reputation, there's a surprising fact. The region has yet to witness a documented fatality caused by these spiders. The human body's resilience often dilutes the venom to non-lethal levels, offering a glimmer of relief amidst the fear. In the event of a bite, cautionary measures swing into action. Medical professionals recommend supportive treatments involving opiates to alleviate pain and benzodiazepines to ease spasms. South Africa even provides an antidote for severe cases, although its usage is sparing due to potential side effects for those allergic to the venom. Epinephrine, or diphenhydramine, steps in to counter subsequent anaphylaxis. So, as you venture through the wild landscapes of southern Africa, keep an eye out for these intriguing yet formidable creatures. The button spiders, with their enigmatic aura, remind us of the delicate balance between fascination and caution in the natural world. Number 14. Violin Spider In the shadowy corners of our homes, a silent artist lurks, sporting a violin-shaped mask on its back, the notorious brown recluse often dubbed the Violin Spider. Picture this, a sleek, almost heart-shaped body, a drizzle of grayish-yellow-brown adorned with fine gray hairs. Its legs, darker than midnight, are slender and agile, dancing gracefully as it roams. What sets these stealthy creatures apart is their messy, irregular webs, home to their precious egg sacs, where they orchestrate their craft. Encounters with these recluse artists can lead to a curious dance with fate. Their bites, though rarely noticed at first, unleash a swelling, redness, and tenderness at the sight, leaving victims in discomfort. Some unfortunate souls might even experience chills, nausea, or fever, although such dramatic reactions are as rare as a shooting star. Yet the actual danger lies in the aftermath, as the skin at the bite might ulcerate, forming a deep, slow healing wound that beckons infection. However, fear not, for the specter of death from these bites is as elusive as the spiders themselves. But here's the twist. These crafty brown recluses don't discriminate. Even our beloved pets can fall victim to their enigmatic charms. It's a phenomenon that fuels the exterminating industry, where experts battle these recluse artists and other unwelcome creatures, striving to restore the peace within our homes. So next time you spot a violin-shaped mark scuttling in the shadows, remember the dance of the hermit, a tale of mystery, danger, and the artistry of survival. Stay cautious, for in the heart-shaped cephalothorax of the violin spider, a world of secrets awaits. Number 13. The Enchanting World of Blue-Footed Baboon Spiders Step into the fascinating realm of the blue-footed baboon spider, a tarantula-style marvel that calls South Africa's KwaZulu-Natal and its neighboring regions home. Picture this, a creature with a body length reaching 30 millimeter, not the biggest in its genus, yet far from minuscule. What sets them apart? Their enchanting feature vibrant cobalt blue feet glowing mysteriously from the penultimate leg segment down to the ground, accentuated by a striking black line running along their abdomen. These nocturnal creatures are nature's artisans, fashioning protective nests under rocks and rotting tree trunks, sometimes delving 30 centimeters beneath the Earth's surface. Spot them between November and March when they come alive during the South African summer, engaging in their lively mating rituals amidst the wilderness. The mystery surrounding their venomous nature adds an intriguing layer to their allure. While it's believed they possess venom, detailed studies are yet to uncover the full extent of their potency. However, one thing is clear. Their existence faces peril. The surge in demand from exotic pet enthusiasts, coupled with habitat destruction driven by climate change, threatens their population. In the dusky shadows of South African woodlands, the blue-footed baboon spider pirouettes a delicate dance between mystery and vulnerability. As we marvel at their beauty, let's also join hands to protect these enchanting creatures from the challenges that loom large, ensuring their graceful dance continues for generations to come. Number 12. King Baboon Spider. The King Baboon Spider takes center stage. The King Baboon Spider is a member of the Pelanobius clan from East Africa. 
These hefty tarantulas with leg spans reaching up to 20 centimeters are masters of warning vibrations. Their venomous bite, while not fatal, can induce localized and systemic symptoms for over 40 hours, making them fascinating yet formidable creatures. Beware, though. They come with moodiness, often displaying quick defensiveness. In the Battle of the Baboons, these tarantulas bring awe-inspiring beauty and a touch of danger. Marvel at their magnificence while respecting their wild spirits, for these arachnids are a testament to the wonders and complexities of the natural world. The color of the king baboon spider ranges from rusty brown to orange. They reside in the East African shrublands and grasslands, typically employing flora as a protective cover for their burrows. They are one of the few tarantulas that, in addition to rearing and striking, employ stridulation as a key defense strategy. They make the stridulation sound by rubbing the femurs of their first and second pairs of legs together. They are popular among collectors, but they are fiercely protective and lack urticating hairs, making them unsuitable for novices. They contain extremely potent venom, although none are known to be lethal to humans. For five days, a bite from a smaller spider would induce acute pain and localized irritation. Number 11. Kissing Bug in the realm of seemingly innocent insects, there's a tiny menace wreaking havoc with a peck on the face. Meet the kissing bug, a deceptive creature known as the coninos bug, barber bug, or vinchuca in Spanish. Despite its cute nickname, this minuscule assassin carries a dangerous secret. It transmits a parasite that leads to Chagas disease, a silent killer lurking in unsuspecting victims. Measuring about the size of a penny, these bugs stealthily feast on human blood. Their bites might seem harmless, but they leave behind a problematic legacy. After a bite, they deposit the T. cruzi parasite through their feces, typically rubbed into the wound when the victim scratches the itchy bite. This devious infiltration sets the stage for a potentially fatal journey into the bloodstream. Chagas disease, often undetected until complications arise, quietly ravages the body. Initial symptoms, mirroring common illnesses, often go unnoticed. However, during the chronic phase, which can last a lifetime, around 20% of those infected face severe heart or digestive problems. An enlarged heart, heart failure, and cardiac arrest are dire outcomes. This microscopic threat isn't confined to Latin America. Kissing bugs have made their way into the United States, especially in homes made of mud or adobe, where they thrive in cracks and crevices. With climate change shifting their habitats northward, these bugs are becoming an increasingly significant concern. Chagas disease transmission can occur through various channels, including pregnancy, organ transplantation, and consuming contaminated food. Knowledge and awareness are our most potent weapons against this stealthy foe. If you're from regions where these bugs are prevalent or have traveled there, keep an eye out for symptoms, especially if heart problems arise, Vigilance and education can save lives in the face of this unexpected danger. Number 10. Botflies. Ah, the mysterious world of botflies. These tiny creatures belonging to the Estridae family are far more fascinating than you might think. Imagine a fly whose larvae become internal parasites of mammals, with life cycles as diverse as the species themselves. Some are known as warble flies, others as heel flies or gadflies. The term bot in their name refers to larvae, and these creatures are skilled at finding hosts, depositing eggs, and letting their larvae grow within the host's flesh or alimentary tracts. But here's the kicker. These bot flies aren't just intriguing for their parasitic tendencies, they've also found their way onto our plates. In colder climates where reindeer and caribou roam, the larvae of caribou warble flies, Hypoderma tarandi, become available during butchery. Historical records and ancient art indicate that these larvae have been consumed since pre-modern times. Imagine people relishing the taste of these larvae, with some even describing them as having a flavor reminiscent of milk. Yet botflies aren't just a curiosity for food enthusiasts. They play a significant role in the ecosystem, though their parasitic habits can challenge livestock and wildlife. Their intricate life cycles, the way they deposit eggs on hosts, and their ability to survive in various mammalian bodies make them a subject of scientific intrigue. 
So next time you hear about bot flies, remember they're not just nature's peculiar parasites, but also a testament to the extraordinary diversity of life, from the depths of the wild to the unexpected corners of our culinary adventures. Number 9. Death Stalker in the vast deserts of North Africa through to the Middle East, a creature lurks, bearing a name as menacing as its nature, the Death Stalker, Leurus quinquestriatus. This scorpion, also known as the Palestine Yellow Scorpion, or Omdurman Scorpion, is a member of the Buthidae family, infamous for its potent venom and dangerous sting. Its scientific name, Leurus quinquestriatus, translates to five-striped smooth tail, a deceptive name for such a deadly predator. This vibrant yellow arachnid, spanning 30 to 77 millimeters, resides in the Sahara, Arabian Desert, Thar Desert, and Central Asia. Its venom is a potent concoction of neurotoxins, including chlorotoxin and charybdotoxin, making it one of the most challenging scorpion species. Although typically not fatal to healthy adults, its sting poses a severe threat to children, the elderly, and those with allergies or existing health conditions. The Death Stalker's venom, however, hides a surprising secret. One of its components, chlorotoxin, has shown promise in treating brain tumors. In innovative clinical trials, chlorotoxin attached to a fluorescent molecule acts as brain tumor paint, illuminating cancerous cells during surgery, a groundbreaking development in the fight against brain cancer. However, owning a Death Stalker comes with a heavy legal price. Due to its danger, Many countries have strict regulations and permits regarding its possession. Even with the risk, this lethal beauty continues to captivate researchers and enthusiasts alike, showcasing the intricate balance between nature's danger and its potential for medical breakthroughs. Number 8. The Africanized Honeybee In the intriguing world of bees, the Africanized honeybee, often ominously labeled as the killer bee, emerges as a fascinating but potentially dangerous hybrid. This bee variant, born from the fusion of the East African lowland honeybee with the European honeybee subspecies, has a chilling history that began in 1956 in Brazil. Introduced initially to boost honey production, these bees staged a daring escape in 1957, setting off a chain of events that led to their rapid spread through South and North America. What makes the Africanized honeybee infamous is its highly defensive nature and lightning-fast reaction to disturbances. With their ability to chase perceived threats over a quarter mile, these bees have earned their menacing reputation. Although their sting isn't more potent, their sheer aggression, propensity to attack in more significant numbers, and relentless pursuit make them more perilous than their European counterparts. Interestingly, their infiltration techniques into European honeybee colonies are as cunning as they are ruthless. Through strategic mating flights, Africanized drones overpower their European rivals, resulting in more aggressive Africanized offspring. While these bees don't actively seek human targets, their hair-trigger temper and swift reactions make them a significant concern. So next time you hear a buzz, keep an eye out. It might be the Africanized honeybee, a tiny creature with a not-so-tiny reputation for turning peaceful moments into potentially dangerous encounters. Stay cautious, stay safe, and respect the power within the buzz. Number 7. Asian Giant Hornets In the colorful realm of insects, one creature towers above the rest, the Asian Giant Hornet, also known as Vespa mandarinia. Hailing from the enchanting lands of East and Southeast Asia, this formidable insect earned its title as the world's most giant hornet. But wait, the story doesn't stop there. In a surprising turn of events, these hornets embarked on an unexpected journey, making their presence felt in the Pacific Northwest of North America. A buzz of concern filled the air as experts worried about their invasive potential. These giant hornets are no ordinary bugs, they have a taste for adventure, preferring the serene charm of low mountains and lush forests. And when it comes to making a home, they're masters at it, digging nests, co-opting tunnels and settling near pine roots, showcasing their ingenuity. But what truly sets them apart is their potent sting, a nasty cocktail that can send shivers down the bravest spine. The venom, laced with a neurotoxin called mandarotoxin, delivers a fiery sensation akin to a hot nail being driven into the skin. What makes these hornets truly astonishing is not just their size, but the potent impact they can have. 
While a single sting might not be lethal, multiple strikes can be fatal, especially for those allergic to their venom. The tale of the Asian giant hornet reminds us of nature's wonders and the delicate balance between fascination and caution. After all, in the world of insects, there's always more than meets the eye, or in this case, the stinger. Number six, Doralus, nature's mighty miniature warriors. In the heartlands of Central and East Africa, a remarkable army marches silently known as Doralus. But to the locals, they are the mighty driver ants, safari ants, or siafu. Picture this, vast colonies of over 20 million individuals, creating temporary underground cities with their powerful mandibles. These ants are nature's miniature warriors, possessing physical might and an intriguing lifestyle. Unlike their New World counterparts, Doralus ants are not picky eaters. They thrive on a diverse diet of arthropods, showcasing their adaptability in the wild. What sets them apart is their unique approach to habitation. They construct intricate subterranean bivouacs, intricate temporary homes where they reside for a few days or even up to three months, showcasing their engineering prowess. Interestingly, these driver ants wield powerful stingers yet seldom use them. Instead, their scissor-like mandibles do most of the talking, highlighting their sophisticated hunting techniques. Imagine encountering the queen of this ant world, the most significant living ant, a giant measuring 40 to 63 millimeters. In the wild, these ants are not just insects, they are a force of nature. Their story, a saga of teamwork, adaptability, and strength, paints a vivid picture of survival in the wilderness. Next time you think of ants, think of Doralus, the awe-inspiring safari ants reigning supreme in the microcosm of the animal kingdom. Now, it's time for today's subscriber pick. Ticks, tiny insects often overlooked, can pose serious health risks. When a tick latches onto a human, it burrows its mouthparts into the skin, feeding on blood. In some cases, ticks can transmit harmful pathogens like bacteria and viruses, causing diseases like Lyme disease and Rocky Mountain spotted fever. These infections, if left untreated, can lead to severe complications. As we can see in this picture where a tick bite resulted in large infected pustules on a man's back. Such pustules are typically a result of the body's immune response to the tick's saliva or the bacteria it carries. Prompt removal of ticks and proper medical attention are crucial to prevent such occurrences and potential complications. Can you tell us what are some effective ways to prevent tick bites and protect oneself from tick-borne diseases? Let us know in the comments below. Number five, cone snails. In the vibrant tapestry of marine life, cone snails, with their captivating colors and intriguing shapes, hide a deadly secret. These alluring sea creatures belong to the conidae family and are adorned with shells that boast exquisite patterns. Found predominantly in tropical waters, Cone snails have a history that spans from the Eocene to the Holocene epochs. However, beneath their enchanting appearance lies a potent weapon, venom. Equipped with modified radula teeth resembling harpoons, cone snails use their venom glands to attack, paralyze, and devour their prey. This venom, primarily composed of diverse peptides, contains toxins with varying effects. While some stings might resemble a bee or hornet's sting, Others, especially from larger species like Conus geographus and Conus tulipa, can prove fatal to humans. Their venom, intriguingly, holds potential for medical applications, showcasing the paradoxical nature of these fascinating creatures. Despite their perilous abilities, cone snails' beautifully patterned shells often entice unsuspecting admirers. Yet disturbing them can provoke a defensive response, leading to harpoon strikes capable of penetrating even protective gear. A cone snail sting symptoms are alarming, ranging from intense pain and swelling to muscle paralysis and respiratory failure. This enigmatic world serves as a stark reminder of the delicate balance between fascination and danger in the intricate web of nature. So while admiring the ocean's wonders, it's crucial to respect the hidden dangers these mesmerizing cone snails possess. This lesson underscores the wild and unpredictable beauty of our planet's marine realm. Number four, box jellyfish. In the enchanting depths of the ocean resides a silent assassin, the box jellyfish, a captivating and deadly creature. 
These mysterious beings with their cube-shaped bodies house a venom so potent that it can deliver excruciating pain and even claim human lives. Among the notorious culprits are Chironex Flaccari, Karukia Barnese, and Malo Kingi, whose stings can induce cardiac arrest within minutes. Australia, a land surrounded by azure waters, has witnessed the wrath of Chironex Flaccari, responsible for numerous fatalities since 1883. Even the tiny yet venomous Irukandji box jellyfish has left its mark, causing severe symptoms known as Irukandji syndrome. The ocean off Hawaii's shores becomes perilous, especially after a full moon, as box jellyfish gather to spawn, prompting lifeguards to close beaches to protect swimmers. Venturing into the Malay archipelago, the danger intensifies. Limited access to medical facilities in places like the Philippines amplifies the threat, leading to tragic outcomes. In Japan, Chironex Yamaguchi lurks, implicated in several fatalities. Thailand and even the coastal waters of Texas have not escaped the menace, with fatal incidents reminding us of the silent danger that lurks beneath the waves. To counter this peril, communities have erected warning signs and first aid stations, offering a glimmer of hope amidst the shadows. Remember when you plunge into the ocean's embrace, respect its inhabitants, for within its depths, the box jellyfish, the silent assassin, commands both wonder and fear. Number 3. Cicada Killer Wasps In the vibrant world of insects, few creatures can rival the alarm-inducing prowess of cicada killer wasps, scientifically known as Specia speciosus. Imagine encountering these imposing solitary wasps, often dubbed giant cicada killers or sand hornets, in your backyard, a sight bound to raise your heartbeat. Despite their daunting size, menacing appearance, and occasional dive-bombing antics, these wasps rarely threaten humans. The males, engaged in their intimidating flight displays, lack stingers altogether, and the females, while possessing an egg-laying structure that doubles as a weak stinger, deliver a mild sting akin to a pin scratch. Identifying these remarkable insects is relatively easy. Their large size, ranging from 1 to 1 and 3 fourth inches, and distinct black, red, and yellow coloration set them apart. Interestingly, cicada killers mimic the warning coloration of other wasps, like yellow jackets, which possess painful stingers, adding to the confusion and fear among those who encounter them. However, their captivating appearance and cryptic behavior often lead to misconceptions, generating fear, anxiety, and occasional panic. For homeowners, golfers, and picnickers, close encounters with giant cicada killers might cause trepidation. Males zealously guard their underground nests, making them a nuisance in various outdoor settings. Despite their aggressive demeanor, these wasps pose little threat, their stings being minor inconveniences, except for individuals with heightened sensitivity to bee or wasp stings. Number 2. Saddleback Caterpillar's Secret Sting in the enchanting tapestry of eastern North American forests lies a vibrant danger, the saddleback caterpillar scientifically known as Acharya stimulea, a beautiful and perilous creature. This colorful caterpillar, adorned in bright hues, conceals a sinister secret within its spines. Touch it, and you risk a painful encounter. The saddleback caterpillar is not just an ordinary insect, it is a venomous marvel, its spines housing potent poison glands. A brush against its delicate frame can unleash a sharp sting, akin to the bite of a wheel bug, delivering an unexpected and intense pain. Picture this. You find yourself in its path, feeling a sharp, stinging sensation, a pain more potent than a typical bee sting. If redness and swelling follow, consider yourself fortunate, for these are the usual aftermath of this caterpillar's touch. The pain, though intense, is typically short-lived, lasting between one to three hours. However, the memory of the encounter might linger much longer. This creature's tail serves as a reminder of nature's intricate balance between beauty and danger. So next time you wander amid trees and ornamental plants, keep an eye out for this bewitching yet perilous creature and let its story be a cautionary note in the symphony of the wild. Stay curious but beware of the bewildering beauty of the saddleback caterpillar. Number 1. Southern Flannel Moth Caterpillar in the world of arachnids, the brown recluse spider, aptly nicknamed the violin spider, boasts a distinctive violin-shaped marking on its cephalothorax, making it easily identifiable. 
With a body colored in shades of grayish-yellow-brown and long, slim legs, these spiders roam freely, often unnoticed. Despite their unassuming presence, a brown recluse bite can lead to swelling, redness, and even an ulcerated wound. While rarely fatal, their bites can cause disfigurement and pose a threat to pets. But the brown recluse isn't the only deceptive creature out there. Meet the southern flannel moth caterpillar, a fluffy-looking insect with a venomous secret. Often mistaken for a harmless pet, this caterpillar's soft appearance belies its dangerous spines. Coming into contact with these spines results in excruciating pain and swelling. A recent incident involving a five-year-old child in Texas is a stark reminder of their potency. Quick thinking by her teachers, who promptly removed the spines, prevented a potentially severe reaction. These tales of nature's cunning beauties underline the importance of awareness. Vigilance is crucial from the unsuspecting brown recluse to the deceptively cuddly caterpillar. So next time you encounter a spider or a fluffy creature in the wild, remember appearances can be deceiving, and caution is your best defense against these venomous marvels. We hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you in the next one.